Hey guys and welcome back to another quest guide. Today's quest is the 2012 free to play quest Let Them Eat Pie. Now there are no skill requirements and no enemies to defeat and all the items can be obtained during the quest. If you want to buy them beforehand all you'll need is an empty pot, a potato, raw crayfish, wheat and some fishing bait. So let's get started. To start the quest, you need to go to Taverly and speak to Nails Newton outside the pub. He is right next to the Taverly Lodestone. So just spam through his chat. And select accept quest. Spam through his chat again. When you finish talking to him, you can go to the south of Taverly, straight across the bridge to the wheat field, which is next to Taverly Dungeon, and collect your wheat if you haven't already. And there is some fishing bait on the ground on your way down to the wheat field, just next to the bridge. So head back up and go north to the mill. And then go upstairs. Then you need to put the wheat and the fishing bait in the hopper and then operate the controls. Go back down the stairs and pick up the empty pot from the table if you don't have one already. Just to the south there. And then use the pot with the maggoty flour in the bin to fill it. Then go back out and talk to Nails and he will give you a maggoty pie shell. So next, go to your northeast, just to the lake, and here, and catch yourself a raw crayfish if you don't have one already. And then go to the flax field, just here, and watch the cutscene. Go back south again and talk to Nails. Spam through his chat. And then go north and just, just below the flax field, Farmer Jones is there. If you speak to him, you can get a free potato if you don't have one already. Then you need to go northwest to the little snowy area. There will be a hole in the floor. All you need to do is put your potato into the hole, which is just here on the north side of that snowy patch. Then use the potato or the crayfish on the maggoty pie shell. That will make the pie. Now you need to cook the pie. So if you go back down to the pub, which is right next to Nails, there is a range in there you can use to cook the pie on. Once you cook the pie, go back outside and talk to Nails again. Spam through his chat. Then go back down to the mill 
and you need to pickpocket Foppish Pierre. He's just to the west of the mill here. And you will get some expensive spices. Then use the expensive spices on the pie and go back up to the pub and go up to the first floor. Speak to Roller the Stout. We'll go into a cutscene. Spam through the chat. Spam through the chat and choose any option for the name of the pie. And then just wait for the cutscene to finish. You'll go downstairs. And you'll have some sound effects to listen to. Spam through the chat and choose any option. Whether you want to listen to it or not is up to you. And then when you get control again, go back outside and speak to Nails. And choose option three. I best get on with it then. Go back inside and upstairs, open the chest and steal the seal that is inside and go back down again and talk to Nails. You will get given a letter, go back south to Foppish Pierre and deliver the letter to him. And then go back north and speak to Nails once again. Spam through the chat. And that's quest complete. So you will get one quest point, 100 cooking XP, 150 thieving XP, some expensive spices, 5 meat pies and 2 treasure hunter keys.